by audiences. एक सलमान के लिए एक अलग किरदार है इसमें and it's a it's a very warm sort of moving story of human relationships and it's told in a very entertaining and engaging manner. I think the audiences will definitely enjoy it. After that, if some change occurs, that's something that you know I definitely cannot say. Hi, this is Sohil from Glam Sham. My question is to Kabir and Adnan. इस फिल्म में से पहली बार बहुत सी चीजें हो रही जैसे अदनान विल भी लेकिन स्क्रीन पे आएंगे पहली बार फॉर अ सॉन्ग कवाली पहली बार गा रहे हैं और ये जो दरगाह है आई थिंक सो देव वहाँ पर भी पहली बार ऐसे शूट हो रहा है तो वुड यू लाइक टू शेयर समथिंग ऑन दिस पर्टिकुलर जी आई मीन यू राइट लॉट्स ऑफ फर्स्ट ऐश मुकाम दरगाह में पहले कभी शूटिंग नहीं हुई है लेकिन इतनी खूबसूरत लोकेशन है इतना खूबसूरत दरगाह है वो कि जब हम आ गए आई न्यू दैट दिस इज़ द राइट लोकेशन फॉर अस टू शूट दिस वेरी वेरी सिग्निफिकेंट पोर्शन ऑफ द फिल्म तो हमने उनसे बात करी और कश्मीर में वैसे भी एवरीबडी वॉज वेरी हेल्पफुल एंड कोऑपरेटिव एंड दे मोर देन वेलकम डज टू शूट ओवर दै देन येस वी सिंग अदनान फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम परफॉर्म हिज सॉन्ग ऑन स्क्रीन Um, that was very important for us because जो जो track है वो एक बहुत ही moving track है और एक film में भी एक बहुत important point पर आता है तो हम ऐसी एक शख्सियत चाहते थे जो it's not only a voice but also face we wanted the the credibility of 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 a good man singing that song and uh, so Adnan was a unanimous choice um, and uh, I think you will enjoy the song even more when you see it in the narrative of the film. Adnan, do you I feel? Really? <laughs> this is that moment when I'm speechless, <laughs> which is very rare. I don't know how to respond to that. Kabir, hi, this side. Faridun from Bollywood Angama, this side. Uh, it's being said that uh, the you have presented Salman Khan in the promos of, uh, from what we've gathered so far, that you presented Salman Khan in a very different manner from what the way he has been done in the last few films, uh, because there had been a stereotype of Salman being presented in action format and and all those action scenes, which are not there, and which is a refreshing change as well. Many are loving it. Uh, so, uh, was it a conscious decision on your part to present Salman Khan differently? It wasn't a conscious decision to uh, uh, present him differently. It was just a conscious decision to follow what is true for this story. And in this story, he would have to be different from, say, the films that he's been doing for the past seven, eight years. Uh, and this is something that both Salman and I both sort of instinctively, uh, you know, and, uh, wanted to portray this character in a certain way. So yes, I think the glimpses that you're getting of his character uh, from the trailers and the songs uh, is uh, I mean people are, are reacting to it and they are understanding that it is going to be a very different character uh, for Salman. But I think ultimately it's you know let's wait till the film comes because her film se pehle hum yehi bolte hain alag hai alag hai alag hai. Uh, India Pakistan the way uh, the entire theme somewhere is India Pakistan as well. Uh, off late we've seen a lot of uh, I think uh, resistance from both the countries. Uh, there a lot of, lot has been happening in terms of uh, television battles are happening as well in terms of newsroom television battles are happening as well. Uh, do you do you think that maybe this film can can add in terms of people to people contact or do you feel that there may be some resistance from certain quarters as well? No, I feel that the the newsroom battles that you're talking about they are in very bad taste. Uh, they just uh, bring in this whole element of jingoism and and you know chest thumping, which is distaste in civil society. Uh, and in some sense, this film is a reaction to that. Um, you know, uh, this is something I've always felt very strongly about. Um, we we all have, and I also feel very strongly against what say the uh, you know the the establishment of Pakistan is doing in some quarters. But we cannot take that and put that responsibility on the people of Pakistan. The whole point of this film is that ultimately the common man is the same, whether he's on this side of the border or that side of the border. And there's terrorism both of. So. So I think um, um, I, you know if there's going to be criticism from some quarters, so be it. Because this is a film that uh, Salman and I truly believe in. I mean, the politics of this film is something that both of us stand by very strongly. Yeah. Yes, of course we would love to. I mean, that, that would be the whole point. Yeah, Kabir Khan here. Uh, what's the social message of this movie? You know, I 
I find it very pompous for a filmmaker to say there's a social message. Uh, there is something that in the film that we're dealing with and uh, uh, it, it is essentially a nice, engaging, entertaining film. And at the end of the film, if some people take away a message from it, great. They probably will enjoy the film even more. But uh, I cannot really articulate and say this is the message of the film because ultimately it's for the audience to take away from the film. And if they don't take it away, then that's my feeling as a director. Uh, Kabir ji. Mr. The message of the film is very profound, actually. Uh, the message is, go watch it. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Ahuja, my question is for you. Uh, we've just heard that there's a major release happening along with your film. Today it's been confirmed. So, will there be any change in the marketing strategy? Which, Which film is this? Which are, with our films, are you one year ahead of us. Achha. That's 2016, Sultan. <laughs> <laughs> Not Sultan, I'm talking about Raiz. With 